Courtney and welcome back. Today I have a really fun video for you. It's a New Year's Eve complete look. It's going to be a makeup look, a hair look, and two different outfits, both casual and more dressy. And this video is also exciting because it's a collab with Rosia, Laura, and she was in the Next Face Awards with me. So you guys probably have seen her videos and she's going to be doing a New Year's Eve look as well. So I will link her channel down below. Make sure to go check hers out and let's jump into the video. I'm doing this a bit backwards today. I'm going to prime my eyes first with this Kate McNabb primer and then I'm using this Smashbox Full Exposure Palette. I'm using the three matte shades on the right. They're kind of a taupe brown just to build up my crease. I'm just going to keep stacking those colors. I did my eyes first because I'm using this pigment from LA Splash. It's really pretty. It's like purple and pinks and whites. So I'm using a wet brush and just applying that. I like to use it wet because it just makes it more pigmented. And then I'm also going in with this NYX Roll-On Shimmer. This is in the color pink, and I'm just applying it directly from the roller. It just adds even more shimmer, and I'm also going in with this platinum shade and just blending that out on top of it. Next, I'm just deepening up my crease a bit more. I'm just constantly building up the colors till I get the deepness that I want. So I'm just blending, 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 keep on doing that. And I did the eyes first today just so that way it doesn't like fall out all over my face on my foundation. But I am going in with my foundation now and this is the Neutrogena Healthy Skin. And I kind of like to do my foundation as soon as possible just because it really helps me get a better idea of how the whole look is gonna pull together. So then I'm going in with this NYX HD concealer and just um, covering my under eye circles and also kind of highlighting with this. And I'm going to use my beauty blender to blend it out. And I'm also going to use this to like clean up the edges of my eyes so it makes it a really defined line. I do this a lot and it works really well. I'm using this Laura Geller bronzer just to warm up my face. I'm not contouring it too much or anything like that, but I'm just warming up my face and doing it very lightly. I'm using my Hourglass highlight. I forgot to take a picture of the product, so I'm just using that to highlight my face. Because when I think of New Year's, I think of lots of shimmer. Then I'm going in with the Smashbox blush in the color Chiffon and just applying it to the apples of my cheeks. And it's just a really nice natural color. Then I'm taking the black and the dark browns and working this under my lower lash line because I'm not going to be using eyeliner on the bottom, but I am using this NYX liquid liner and creating a cat eye on my eyes. I didn't do it too dramatic, but you can make it as big and dramatic as you want because New Year's is totally the time to be dramatic and I always get a little visitor too. <laughs> then I'm using my Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This is one of my favorites. I'm applying a thin coat to the top and to the bottom, but then I'm going to apply some falsies because New Year's is definitely the one time like falsies are a total must. <laughs> then I'm using this Gerard Cosmetics Shimmer of Hope lip gloss. It's one of my favorite nude lip glosses. And that's going to finish off my makeup. On to my hair, I'm using a really small curling wand and I'm curling my hair in small sections and for the side that has the lesser part of the two, I'm curling it away from my face and then the opposite side with the deeper part, I'm curling it towards my face and you'll see the effect that it gives at the end. So I'm just curling my hair in really small curls. As you can see, this side is going towards my face. And then once it cools, I'm going to go ahead and hairspray the crap out of it. You want to put a lot of hairspray in it to really hold. And we do these smaller curls because then we're going to go in and brush it out for these really pretty glamorous waves. And that way it, you don't lose all your curl. I'm pulling back this section and just pinning it and then teasing the section just to lay over it. On to outfits. This is the more casual outfit of the two. These amazing pants are from Fashion Nova and I actually have a coupon code for you guys that I will leave for you down below. They have such cute dresses and they're super, super affordable. They have really cute stuff. And then this top is from Forever 21 and the shoes are from Just Fab. So this is kind of a more casual, comfy New Year's Eve outfit, but it's still very glamorous. This next look is definitely a bit more dressy. This romper is from Charlotte Ruse and these shoes are from Lulu's. They're just like studded and I love this romper. It's super cute and metallic-y. It's great for a night out, but New Year's Eve especially, I think it's adorable and it's really comfy too. 
If it's a little cooler where you live, you can of course add a jacket. This one is from Forever 21 and you can even add some tights with it too. Alright guys, thank you so so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to let me know in the comments down below what your New Year's resolution is. I would love to know. Also, don't forget to check out Rosia's video. Again, I will link it down below. So make sure to go check it out and I will see you guys next time. Bye!